The 2024 ACC Women's Lacrosse Tournament begins in Blacksburg. Our first round doubleheader starts at Thompson Field with the eight-seeded Virginia Tech Hokies hosting the nine-seeded Louisville Cardinals. And the winner of this game taking on top-seeded Syracuse. So we're going to see Olivia Vergano. She's actually limping right now. So again, that knee has been bothering her. And Virginia Tech opens the scoring. It's Paige Tyson who draws first blood. Three really nice pieces and certainly capable of putting up points. Here's Peroni right on the money. Nicole Peroni, woman down goal to tie it at one. Caroline Little trying to shake free, and she scores. Terrific individual effort by the sophomore, Caroline Little, in Virginia Tech, back up by one. This is Allegra Catalano who steps up for the free position. One-on-one -on -one with Jocelyn Torres. Charges in and scores. Catalano fires Louisville in front and cashes in on the power play. Good ball, good off ball movement for Louisville. Watch the surrounding players around the perimeter cutting through. Right on the doorstep. And it's Kokoro Nakazawa again. You always want to have people behind the cage to back up those shots so you can win the possession. Going low and squeezing it through. Perfectly placed. Virginia Tech with a much needed goal and it's Grace New who notches her 10th goal of the campaign. It is paid dividends in this first half. Hokies win the ball back though. An opportunity to tie this game at four and they do! A flamethrower. Ties it at four. Coaches often mention it, and it, it is huge. However, it's not the whole story. It, you know, it goes along with everything. So if you win the draw and, and don't get a great shot off, no big deal. That's not a good thing. And Louisville gets the save on one end and cashes in on the other. The Cardinals back in front. Clemson won 12-11, so interested to see what this battle will be like. Even though Pitt finished winless they certainly will go in with confidence taking Clemson to overtime just three days ago in Louisville you blink and it's back-to-back -back goals for the Cardinals as they've grabbed momentum back here in the second quarter a lot working through render 13 in white has it here in attack mode and scores Lauren render blows it by Sarah Dash it pulls one back for the Hokies Great feed, the finish, Paige Tyson. That's her second goal of the afternoon, and it ties it at six. Another goal, rings the pipe and goes in. What a shot, and Louisville back in front, seven, six with coming up with some great stick checks. But this is going to be a hard fall battle. Both teams even with shots, 13. And it's Paige Tyson again, a first half hat trick for the monster in the middle at five foot 10. Tyson buries her third. 15 seconds on the shot clock. Kokoro dances her way in and scores. So crafty, Coco Nakazawa. And that'll set up an eight meter. Mary Griffin will go four meters behind. And it's Lauren Figgis, the junior, who steps up. One on one with Torres. Steps in, fires low, and scores. Lauren Figgis notches her second goal of the afternoon, and the Cardinals back up by two. We'll hear their name called this week in the NFL draft. Weaving in, great save, Adesh. 
It stays with the Hokies, though. Downey curling around. Feed to Tyson. What a goal! Paige Tyson. She's got half of the Hokies' goals in this first half. That's her fourth. If I was her, I would take it. You still only have 17 seconds left on the shot clock. You got to get back up behind the cage in case she misses it. Peroni rips it low. Torres couldn't get there. And Nicole Peroni cashes in on the Louisville woman up. They conferred about that because she was in the goal circle area. That was not a yellow car, but a great score. Virginia Tech answers with Render. So once again, Louisville goes up by two for the fourth time today. And Virginia Tech answers to cut it back down to one. Two minutes remaining in this third quarter. In a quarter that's been relatively low scoring, considering these teams combined for 17 goals in the first half. Only one goal apiece in the third quarter. Great feed. There it is. Exactly what Louisville needed. And it's Maggie McMahon who notches her second of the afternoon. Here's Lauren Render. They've cleared out for her. Render takes it in and scores. Lauren Render makes it a one goal game. Now just 13 seconds to shoot. Is he cycle trying to shake free? Stings the corner. Is he cycle? What a goal. And Louisville back up by two. Time winding down for Virginia Tech. They need a goal in a hurry. 90 seconds remaining. Render on the run, shoots, and scores. Lauren Render gives Virginia Tech a lifeline. And it's a two goal game with a minute 27 remaining. And Louisville comes to Blacksburg and beats eight seeded Virginia Tech. They're moving on to the ACC quarterfinal. And what a way to start the ACC championship in this first round, Sheehan. A terrific game. We've got our first upset. This is going to be an exciting week. Congratulations to Louisville. A complete team effort.